We'll begin tonight with a Winnipeg mail carrier who says he thought he was doing the right thing by wearing an N95 mask to work, but Canada Post sent him home without pay instead. And right away a supervisor came up to me and told me I can't wear that mask. Corey Gallagher says he was suspended for the day on Tuesday after showing up to work wearing the mask. He says that's after he was told by supervisors he would need to exchange the respirator for a mask provided by Canada Post. Guidance from the Public Health Agency of Canada says medical masks and respirators provide better protection than non-medical masks. Gallagher, who has a nine-month-old and a wife who is immunocompromised, says he can't understand why the Crown Corporation isn't recognizing that. They said the reason why they want us to wear their masks is they're not mask experts or police and they can't be running around monitoring everybody's masks. But the masks that they're giving us are just the level one blue surgical mask. In a statement to CTV News, a spokesperson says Canada Post's mask policy is in line with federal recommendations, adding in part the Public Health Agency of Canada continues to support the use of non-medical masks in community settings made of at least two layers of woven fabric with a third middle layer of filter type fabric or a disposable medical mask for adequate protection. The company fully supports these guidelines and therefore requires all employees to wear a Canada Post supplied face covering, which is either a reusable cloth face covering or a disposable medical mask. Gallagher says he was informed he could wear the N95 with a mask from Canada Post over top. Still, he took a personal day today and says he plans to take more until he gets answers.